Hey, how's it going students? Mr. Monsivice here with another video showing you how to use the annotation tools on Zoom. Your teacher may want to allow you to use these tools so that you can participate live in class alongside with them. Let's get started. We're focusing on three different tools. The first one is the text tool, which you'll want to use if the teacher asks you to type something on the screen. The second tool is the draw tool in case the teacher wants you to circle uh, something on the screen. And the last one is the eraser tool in case you make a mistake and you need to erase something that you did on the screen. Here, the teacher has asked the question, how are you today? If you wanted to answer the teacher, you can click on view options, then go down to annotate. And from here, you will be able to answer the teacher on Zoom using the text box option. Notice how the student is about to click on the middle dot to expand the text box so that more of the response can fit. Next, we're going to learn how to use a draw tool, which allows you to do things like circle a word in case the teacher asks you to circle something in a sentence. You can also use it to highlight words in a sentence, block items on the screen, and even draw arrows. If at any point you need to erase anything, you can click on the eraser button and just drag it over the item you want to erase. As a quick reminder, you are not allowed to annotate unless the teacher gives you permission. If the teacher has not activated the permission, you will not see the annotate option. I hope that this video has been helpful for you and that you have learned to annotate. Please expect to use this in the classroom very soon. And as always, keep it true.